Well, so I, I kind of started surfing um, about five or six months ago when a friend of mine actually offered to teach my oldest daughter. We live in Northern California, so you know we, we have to deal with wetsuits and cold water and all those things. And my daughter did did well. She loved it, but you know consistency with her wasn't to achieve with me and I really took to it. I totally loved it. I've always kind of liked physical challenges. I had a background as a dancer and so I would really liked the idea of thinking of how I could apply all those things, just body body movement stuff to surfing and so um, I just kept kept at it. I got myself a super cheap foam board from Costco and um, probably went out about twice a month maybe max. Then I sort of randomly stumbled on Holly's camp, and um, thought, I was just instantly when I found it. I thought this is this is such an awesome idea, mainly for the surfing, but also just the whole package of um, just doing cool stuff that's you know not too not too girly, not too prissy. Going through the wind, and you're going really fast, but then you're also really kind of feeling this connection with the horse. That um, I mean, I'm not even an experienced rider, but I really you know. I was like feeling how to get that rhythm going, sort of a slight grinding motion with your pelvis and, and you know, to get sort of in that bounce on your butt all the whole way and the wind's blowing through your hair and you're just, you know, going and it's pretty, pretty amazing. And, and just on the beach, it's just so open and the setting is amazing and, um, you know, you just don't get that very easily in the States for sure because beaches like this would be developed and crowded instantly. So it's been really great out here, especially the spot that Holly has for surfing is great because it's, um, you know, you've got a lot of whitewash for beginning surfers and, um, and outside um, with the greenways, I was able to go out there and practice just figuring that stuff out and, and it's great to just come out here and actually not have to worry about crowds. And so today I was really working on um, Kind of paddling to places in the wave that would you know choosing the wave and paddling to the place I, I felt like would be the right place to catch it on and so it's really good great because you can each day kind of work on something specific that you wanted to that you know you need to achieve to get you know right start riding the green waves and it's so awesome how the resort we were at is so involved in the community and really is conscious about doing things right in the, in the specific community that they are and, um, you know, we have some opportunity to kind of look, look and see what's going on and learn about different factors affecting the community. So it's, it's pretty rough life around here for a lot of the locals, but it's also kind of inspiring to see how much a, of a difference little things can make. And um, so, you know, you just feel like you get, you're not just here for just surfing and just thinking about that. You get a really just broad, your whole mind just gets broad, right? the whole experience.